It's time for a grip tip presented by Golf Pride. All right, we talk about this all the time, how important it is for you to lever the club correctly in the backswing. And levering the club correctly in the backswing is going to give you a whole lot more power. Now, how do we do that? Well, one of the ways you do this is you start to think about your thumbs. And your thumbs have to move up this way. So as you start to get the club to move up, you got to feel like you're taking your thumbs and just pointing them up to the sky. So when I start to, to hold the club and I start to go, I don't want to do it right towards my forehead because I'm making a backswing. So I'm going to be, I'm going to have some rotation here. But as I'm rotating, I'm levering the club just like this. And as I start to lever the club up into the air, what I want to get the feeling of is that the handle of the club is below my waist and the head of the club is above my waist. So here's my waist right here coming out. You can see how the handle is below it and the club head is above it. And I've done that by letting my thumbs feel like I'm pointing up into the air just like this. So as we start to do that, that's going to give me a little bit of power. Feel like you're just throwing that up into the air just like that. I get a little bit of, t of power, a little bit of freedom in that motion. A very, very straight shot. Greg, you got to show me that one again because that one really didn't have a lot of turn whatsoever. You can see that ball. That might have moved. I mean, you're talking about a couple of feet. For everybody, that's, that's a straight shot. So in order for you to improve your distance, your freedom, your rhythm, what you've got to do is you've got to feel like you're getting a little bit of wrist set in the backswing. And the way you do that is just focus on getting your thumbs to point up into the air. When you hold the club this way, they're actually pointing down to the ground. They're going down the club shaft like that. So when I want to let this, this club hinge, I want to feel like my wrists are going to lever up into the air and my thumb is going to point up into the air. When I start to get that and I move into the backswing, now you can see the head of the golf club is above my waist and the handle is below it. So as we start to get there, we do those things. Let's see if I can put a little power in this one. I'm going to hinge this and I'm going to get a, that one there had 117 miles an hour of ball speed. Watch this one right here. That one I went at a little bit harder. That's 126 miles an hour ball speed. Yeah, so I lost a little accuracy, but you did see that ball kind of get by that 200 sign. And with a little bit of practice, you'll be able to gener uh, generate some, some club head speed. And you do that by letting those thumbs point up into the air. Do that, and I'm telling you, distance is in your future. That's our grip tip presented by Golf Pride. To improve all parts of your game, subscribe to my channel and click the link below.